Hello everyone and welcome back to Resident Evil 2. So, we actually got to meet Marvin and uh, he actually helped us. And there, there's actually like three, I think it was like three, three gems that we needed to obtain to open up the statue. So let's go ahead and uh, continue the story of Resident Evil 2. So... Yeah, we just arrived at the raccoon police station. I think that's what it is. So, hopefully I don't shite myself. So as you can see, I'm playing in total darkness. I only have my lamp here in front of me. So, let's see where that takes us. So, I saved here. And, uh, yeah. So, Marvin's still here. That's nice. So, we have to open this. This is what I was saying last time. Or earlier we have to have three um what was that badges i don't know what is this place okay we need a key i know we can't use this key because okay we need we need a spade key a green spade key right okay so i was supposed to enter the Ooh, what's this Green herb. What does that do? Wait, what? Um, health and recovery items as you take damage. Your health monitor in the bottom left will drop with from fine to caution to danger. When in danger, quickly heal yourself with a green herb or first aid spray before it's too late. Okay, we got two of those. So a green herb is also a health potion, I guess. Restore you to full health. Ooh. So this is when we really need it. So this is when we were in danger. This is so when we're probably in caution or something. Okay. That uh, that's actually pretty good. So uh let's continue on. Um maybe here. Oh god. It's gotten even darker. Oh my god. Holy shit. That that definitely is still alive. I have Ooh. The notice I had a lot of bullets. That's actually pretty good. So. Oh. For. Ooh. We're being rescued. Ooh. Hey. Please don't move. I know these type of things that happens. It moves. <laughs> the hell dude oh shit oh window what's that window Whoa. combat knife no Whoa. what can I use on the window what the hell a crowbar or something confiscated items maybe we can f oh, okay we need uh, clover clover yeah I mean, we probably need clover there Clover key. Okay, just checking the corners, you know. Just want to make sure nothing pops out of nowhere. So we can exit from here? But why? This feels so unsafe, you know? It's so quiet. I don't like this. Haha, ha. the window's closed. How do you like that, zombie? Let's see. Can we use the knife on that? No. How about we. Okay, you don't need to use that on it. Let's open the door. Oh. Oh my god, the door just closed on me. Again? What the flip? Record of events. So, September 25th. We're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. 
uh, the addendum of 25th. One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and th injuring three others. The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this was simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. Stre stress. 26th. A mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded as we are, it'll be hard for us, any of us, to escape this place. We're not even sure we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. The 27th. There was another clash on the west side of the station around 1pm. 12 people died and there is only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray here. David Ford. Okay. Oh, oh. What the flip? What the hell? <laughs> oh, it's a girl. Oh, wait, let's use a combat knife. Can I use a combat knife? Unequip. How do I? I forgot. There was a key for that. Uh, let's go check. Let's go check the key binds. So how do I fight you? Alright, I'll just shoot you then. You go tell him, Leon. You bastard. Ooh. Don't shine the light there. What's over here? Ammo! Yes! Oh my god! Woohoo! We're getting tons of ammo! Safety deposit room and west room. So, is there a way to be just, uh... Like, not... Shine the light there? I don't think we need to... There's a door here, so let's open it. Okay, we can't open this. At least the zombie doesn't know we're here. That's good. No, this is the... Yeah, keep... Oh my god, okay. Can we go in here? Hell yeah! What is this room? Oh my god, there's a code for this. Enter locker number. Oh, shoot! We can three two oh three. So Oh we can open up these lockers. That's cool. He wants me, but I don't want him. Is it possible that we can just go um Holy shit! Holy shit! I, I want to know how to use my knife. Oh, there you go. There's a knife. He's got to hold space, I guess. Hold on. I'm going to stab you, bro. Oh! I can't use my knife anymore? What happened? What happened to my knife? My knife's gone! What? What the hell? I only used it once? What the? I'm just wasting ammo at this point though. Oh, the knife got stuck on him. Yo, that's actually pretty cool. Oh, there's another knife here. It appears the keypad to the locker's terminal is missing a few keys. I suggest the person responsible for this mess to find some spare keys and fix it right now. You know who you're a bastard. Okay. Okay. Wait, are, really? Oh, it is. Yeah, you're right. It's missing um, two and three. So I guess we just gotta enter the locker number and then we can open the locker. Okay. So we have to find the missing keys for those. Just checking the corners, you know, don't want to... Okay, I see a zombie over there. Okay, 
Okay, let's go over here, because there's nothing here. Okay. <laughs> oh, gosh. What the hell? Oh! He's still alive! What the frip? Bro. Stay down, man. The hell? Oh, this is a creepy corner right here. Tons of painting all over the place. God damn it. Okay. Maybe let's use one since uh, our inventory is quite full. What is this? Oh, so this is what we use for the... Oh... So as a necessary precaution, let's go ahead and backtrack a bit. Because, you know, you'll never know. You'll never know when you'll need to run away from a zombie. Wait, was it on the other side? I think it was on the other side. Okay. So, we can't go here. So I guess we'll have to go back again. We'll have to go around, I guess. Okay, now let's see what's in here. <laughs> okay, just want to make sure nothing's around. Medical benefits of herbs. Humans have used herbs since, uh, to treat sickness and diseases since the dawn of time. In this book, we will explore three such herbs native to the Arc Clay Mountains. Green herbs have the ability to heal basic injuries, while blue herbs have been have long been used to treat poisoning. So there's a poison here. Poison zombies? As red for red herbs, while they are visually appealing, they offer no medical benefits, or so it was thought until recently. It's well known that the co that combining herbs together produces blends that heighten the herbs' effects, but it has been discovered that red herbs can play a big role when pro mixed properly. According to one doctor of Asian medicine, mixing blue and red herbs together produces a blend that will strengthen one's constitution. So, blue and red herbs. Okay. So red herbs... Uh, provide no use at all alone, but if you mix it with other herbs, probably it will heighten the um, the herbs um, effects. So that's cool. Truly, we have only just begun to realize the full potential of these herbs and their ability to heal human body. Further, research is sure to yield even more fascinating results. Oh, save. I didn't know that. I didn't see that. That's cool. We can save now. I feel safer. So what is this? Dark room. There's nothing inside. Good. So, um... Red herb? Are you sure? Okay, well, let's just leave it there for now. I mean, this is a safe room. We have to use this at some point. Okay. We're going to use this at some point. I don't know what, but we'll have to use it at some point. We'll have to create a film, I guess. Hello? Is he still there? Yeah, he's still there. Oh... My God. Ah, oh, I missed. Okay, stay down, please. Please, please. Stay down. God damn it. There's another zombie up there. Ah, he fell down. Stupid ass. Oh god, there's more zombies. Uh, combine? Hell yeah! You got more ammo! Okay, so where to? This is like the second floor, so that's good. Ooh! Uh, we need a knob for this? Okay.
Jesus Christ. What the hell, man? Oh dear. Okay, we need we need code for that. A portable safe? What's that for? What's a portable safe for? Since there's a safe room at the bottom, um, maybe we can go down again. Yeah, maybe we can go down again and put the put the items in there. Okay, bro. I didn't see you! Get out of the way, bro! Can I just jump down? Get away from me! Oh my god, no! Feck. Get in the safe room. Get in the safe room. Whew! Hell yeah! Haha! Bye bye! I'm just glad they don't run. Okay. I am back, room. Okay, let's grab this. So, you can examine an item from different angles by uh, selecting it and using the um, magnifying examine command. You might reveal something that helps you progress. Let's see. Space. I don't get it. What? So there's something inside here, but I don't know how to open it. We'll probably learn more in the future. Okay, just making sure nothing's outside. Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. Okay, there's a red herb here. Right. So let's go to the top floor. Maybe there's a way going down, I guess. Oh, apple. Swap? Why not? Why swap? Let's combine it. Combine with this. Oh, wow. Look at this. Oh, the mannequin. Okay. It scared me for a bit. What's this? <gasps> it's the clover key, but it's color blue. Eh? Eh? What the hell? Ah! What the hell is that? What in the There's zombies in the attic. I don't like this. I thought they were just walking dead zombies. What the hell? There's a room here. Let's go in. Hello. Okay, good. Okay, we got this. We got another board. Let's combine it. Ooh, yeah, we can. A uh, uh, gunpowder again. Ooh, here. Yo, this is creepy as hell. I'm not gonna lie. Fuck, dude. What is this? What is this? Hip pouch? <gasps> More space! Hell yeah! 
Oh, there's another statue here. Oh, that's the statue. Yo, that's the medallion that we need. How do we get in there? Oh, we gotta break this. Hold on. It's C4. I don't think we have anything that we can use on this. But that's good to know that they're, they're, they're the medallions here. Some guy's scribbling. Damn those corporate assholes. They cut me off after all I've done for them. But if that's how it's gonna be, it's so it's gonna be. I'm gonna have a little fun of my own as the world goes to shit. I boarded all those filthy pigs up in a, in a steel pen and set some C4. All I gotta do is detonate it and say sayonara. But it's no fun if it's over too soon. So maybe I'll give that one ra raving loon something to really squeal about. Yeah, maybe I'll give him a little toy and tell, tell him. Kill the guy next to you and I'll spare the others. I wonder what he'll do. You yell about justice and pride, but how many times did you go against me, your own superior? Yeah, you're such a good cop. So good you had to die. Man, this is fun. I need some music for this. Wow. Really? <gasps> yes, ammo again. Woohoo! I'm getting tons of ammo. I feel safer already. Okay, so we need C4 for that. And this guy's freaking shit. Hopefully this. Oh! Okay. Leon, it's Marvin. I need you back here ASAP. Are you okay, Marvin? I've got something to show you. It's important. Copy that. I'll be right there. Oh my god, zombies keep eating each other. Alright, let's explore this place. This seems to be a library. No shit, Sherlock. Fick, dude. God damn it! What the hell? Oh my god! This this library's too old. God damn! Stay down, bitch. That was so freaking close. Holy hell. How do you jump? You can't. So... I guess from here? Yeah? No. Alright. We'll probably have to find like a plank or something. Well, since we took care of the zombies... Let's go down here. Maybe there's something that we can re uh we can interact with. Excuse me. Maybe this. Oh, come on. Really? Okay. Maybe that would work. Come on, Lee. You can, you can definitely jump that, Leon. What? Are you freaking kidding me? The flip? Oh my god, they're alive again. Stay down! I mean, at least these zombies don't fake death. Like, as if they're dead, they're dead. A red book. So what I mean to say is that, I mean, you see this zombie right here. He doesn't like, rah! He doesn't like go like that and uh, grab my foot. You know what I mean? Oh hey, I have. I think I have the key for this. Hello? Oh, it's the place here! 
We're here. We went around. Nice. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Hell yeah, shortcut. Alright, let's see what Marvin has to say. Is he gonna turn? Fun. Oh, it's Claire. Claire should make it. Oh, you know her? Yeah, name's Claire. I came into town with her. You can get to that courtyard through the second floor, east side. I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. Hell yeah. All right, let's go and save Claire in the next part of the video. So that's going to be it for me today, guys. Hope you enjoyed this part of Resident Evil. So um, if you like what you saw, please leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel to show your support. And uh, I will see you guys again in the next part of Resident Evil 2.